Okay, what's up, y'all? We're back with another one of these. The only reason I'm doing it, the only reason, is because y'all enjoyed the last one. I mean, y'all really like me reacting to these ignorant ass people. So why not do it again? Plus, I ain't got no shame in my game. If y'all like me doing something, I would do it right again. You damn straight. But um, anyway, it's not too much I have to say prior to the video up here because I said everything in the last video. If you didn't see it, the link is in the description. You already know what to do. Also, I'm gonna be cutting out parts that aren't that interesting it's interesting not that interesting in this video so if you want to watch the whole thing you want to watch all the ignorance you already know what to do now this one is not the same this one is best racist fails uh racist teachers getting on now i ain't never really experienced no racist teachers but i experienced teachers that like i called racist because i was mad but anyway let's do the damn thing what are we waiting for <laughs> Okay, attention, this video is because racial slurs in the fifth language that some viewers might find it German. Okay. Alright. All this ain't happened 2017, like I said. And I can't help if the video is low quality or you can't hear it. It's not my fault. You Say that shit again, my nigga. Nah, hey, fuck hey, you. Fuck you up. Say it again. <coughs> say it again. Hey, hey, say some racist shit again. Nah, break your motherfucking mouth. Ooh. Say some shit again. Ooh. Call me another motherfucking horse stick. Or say I gotta hang myself and I will fuck you up, my nigga. Ooh. I'm not fucking playing with you. He said all Call that. Call me another one. Call me another one. I'm gonna beat your ass. Don't say nothing, nigga. Don't say nothing. I don't want you to say nothing. You say anything else, I'm gonna hit you. Don't say nothing. Call me another motherfucking horse thief. He didn't do nothing wrong. Don't say shit. But I'm just saying. Don't say shit. Can you don't, come outside? Don't, me don't say nothing. Say something. I swear to God, I'm can, bro. Can you please come outside? I'm not going nowhere, man. Say something. I'm gonna fuck you up. Uh -oh. Say something else. Uh -oh. Say something else. I'm gonna break all the motherfucking teeth in your mouth, my nigga. You know everybody in here trying to stay serious and shit, like all oh, calm, like they scared and stuff. I will be that one nigga in the back smiling my ass. I don't know why, but I smile at the worst times sometimes. And this right here, I damn sure would be smiling. I'd be like, bruh. <laughs> I wouldn't say calm down. I wouldn't say get him. I'd just sit there and smile my ass off. I dare you. Shit, I bro. My nigga. <laughs> Okay, if y'all can't hear what he just said, because I can barely hear it. So don't cuss. No, no, nobody better not be in this video cussing me out, TJ. I can't hear the video. TJ, the video is really, really shitty quality. I can't see for real. It's not my fault. It's the compilation. Anyway, he said, um, basically, the teacher said nigga. He didn't say that the other word. He said nigga, the word that we use nowadays. And he said that the word has been, I forgot what the word he used, but he said it's been used so much that it's not used as a negative term, so anybody can use it. That's what he's saying. If it's not used as a negative term, then anybody can use it. And apparently, this guy right here doesn't feel that way. He asked all the white people in the class, do you say nigga? Do you say nigga? Do you say nigga? He said only us black people they can say nigga. Now, I can understand where people come from when they say that. I just don't like saying that personally because I don't like telling people what they can and can't do unless it, unless it, like, it has something to do with something that belongs to me, like in my house or something like that. But um, basically, he's saying that the word doesn't mean anything negative, so why can't he say it? He should be able to say it. It doesn't mean what it used to mean a long time ago. And the black dude ain't really feeling that. Okay, you hear it in, in a bunch of songs. Are those people Bye. being negative when they Bye. use Bye. Black Bye. Bye. He said, if you hear it in a bunch of songs, this, this is just in case y'all can't hear it. Y'all probably can't hear it, but oh fucking well, you gonna hear me repeat it. He said it's used in a lot of songs and all those people using it as negative and the dude said, by black men. He's, there's people that's using it as black men. By black men. By black men. What does the word mean when they use it? What does the word mean when they use it? Eminem never said it. You say a word, it means friend. And if I say a word, that same word, it means something different. Yes, that's not true. Just the fuck. It's not. It's not. It's not. It's not. It's not. He said, if the word says friend and you guys use it as friend, if I say it, does that 
it then it means friend. And he said, no, it doesn't. See, we get we get none of the we get none of the certain we get none of the air, boy. We getting under the skin right now. I'm not saying a word. This ain't for me to speak on. <laughs> He said if you he he basically brought up the whole difference between nigga and nigger and he said uh the teacher said nobody says nigger and he said the word and then he said you just said it so yeah He said, if we're having a conversation and you say the word, I can't say it. When we're trying to reference the word, you know. I'm just getting y'all. I'm just, just in case y'all can't hear it. Somebody so, who is a man who's fucking racist to my fucking teacher? Don't yeah. say that shit. I'm not calling you anything. I don't give a fuck. No one's calling you. You said it. Ever. You said it. You said it. I'm still. If, if we're in a class and I'm teaching you, hey, the word nigger is an old. I'm fucking nigger! He said, if I'm teaching you and I say that the word nigger, and he said, stop fucking saying that shit, shit and he slammed the desk on, on the ground. Okay, so what's y'all take on that? Y'all think he was right or y'all think the teacher was right? Y'all think it's okay to reference the word if you don't mean it in a negative way? Or, or do you think um, you don't need to be saying it? Which one do y'all think? I'm gonna let y'all decide on that. I ain't saying shit. Because it could, it could go both ways for me. <laughs> Just because you're telling that you've been serving this your whole entire life. And then throwing everything beneath it away because it doesn't pertain to you. I'm sorry, you know but what? you are. No, 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 no. I let you I'm talk. No, no, no. I let you talk. You're going to let me talk. Oh, my God. I'm sorry that this oh, is the way it is. It is fucked up. But white people control everything. And that's not fair. That is true. And when anybody, any other minority tries to say anything about it or change it, we're complaining or we're ungrateful or all this stuff because you know, this girl right here this looks so but then you say something not, about not in the mood oh i don't there's too many latinos or there's too many i didn't say that then you did that's exactly i said i want to you don't you she, said no you mind she, she agreed she said that's exactly country. what she said i did not because say there that. will be too many latinos you, said, you want to preserve the american culture there is no american culture american culture got mayonnaise and because you are white and you are so close-minded, you refuse to accept that. You refuse to accept Don't tell me I'm close-minded. Everything you've said to me is close-minded. Just close -minded. because I don't agree with you doesn't mean you I'm close-minded. I, I've had conversations with people that don't agree with me, but if they at least listen and try to accept, you're, like, you're not accepting the truth. Why do I have to accept what you think is right? You need to accept the Why? truth, not what I think is right. What's and let me tell you one other thing. <laughs> yes. Get out of my class. Get out of my class. Get out of my class, man. Yeah, I let you forget you. Get out of my class. You're gonna sit here and get out of here. Get out of your damn neck. Get out. Leave. Get out. Leave. She had it. God, I feel like I just like somebody just took my soul and just like just get it I get got a good throw and threw it back into high school, bro. Them days when the teachers got mad and said you're getting a zero. Oh my God, bro, you are all kidding zeros, bro. This teacher is typical my school teacher, bro.
Okay. <laughs> okay. At first I was like, okay, she's mad at a black student. That doesn't mean she's racist. Like, this is pointless. This didn't make no sense to me. But then she said, you're idiots. Okay, that was already bad. You can't just out be out here calling people kids idiots because the you're supposed to be educating them and they won't learn. Like, don't you think there's something wrong with the teacher? That was okay, too. I mean, you, you ain't supposed to be saying that. You ain't supposed to be calling people kids idiots, especially if you're the one that's trying to teach them. But when you say... Do you want to be a broke ass nigga that's going to get shot? You cross the line. I don't give a fuck how mad you are. You don't say no stupid shit like that. Look at his face. <laughs> okay, it's not funny, but still. You don't say no shit like that to nobody, kids. Do you want to be a broke ass nigga that's going to get shot? That's like, that's shit you say out in the street. But that ain't shit you supposed to tell a whole bunch of, uh, a whole bunch of students that's black. Like, come on now. <laughs> Get tripping. You're tripping. It just goes to show, man, there's some people that just don't know what to say out their mouth. I wouldn't really call it racist all the way, but I damn sure would call it ignorant. Some of that shit you just don't fucking say, especially not to no damn students that you're supposed to be teaching. Like... Get your shit together, man. Y'all are just so embarrassing to yourselves. But anyway, man, go ahead and give a thumbs up, man. If you want me to keep doing this, you already know what to do. Leave me links, leave me thumbs up, and leave me comments. That's all you got to do. And I am out.